Okay, and we're back. <laughs> Just had someone to eat as well. Okay, so she's pregnant, right? We kind of need a nursery, so we might have to convert one of the rooms into a nursery. I mean, there is the attic, but you know what? No, we're not having the baby in an attic, uh, to be honest. So I'm thinking... I just realised as well, we gave Juniper like a really small tiny room and I kind of like the idea of Vlad kind of not being that very nice to his wives, like he's had a few relationships which have all resulted in kids so I feel like his wives are like uh, -uh. and the kids clearly don't really enjoy his time because they've left but I think Maybe Juniper's got to stay in this room. And maybe this room can be for the baby. Obviously, I don't know what gender the baby's going to be. Um, but And it's a very pink room. But maybe we just change it. I mean, yeah, any gender can have pink, though. Or do we have it? So Vlad is actually quite mean. And he's like, nah, the baby's got to stay in this room with you. I kind of like that idea better, to be fair. Yeah, we might go for that. So she's not needing a crib or anything yet, but she's sad though. But she's also just really in spite. <laughs> and she was like super energised. I honestly don't think she cares all that much. To be fair, she's just watching TV. She's, she's happy as Larry, it's fine. Seeing if there's anything like coming up. Obviously this isn't my save file. So there is like different holidays on here we don't have like new year's or like christmas but i feel like we should have a new year's surely countdown to midnight we can have drinking party spirit make resolutions i think that'll be fair enough for new year's eve i was gonna put christmas but then i like with vampires you know what where are vampires from and do they celebrate Christmas? I have no idea. Where's Juniper from? I don't know. Maybe we could celebrate like Yule. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll do that. Where would that be? Maybe the Wednesday? We'll have Father Winter. Come. We'll have festive spirit. Give gifts. Open presents. Uh, that should be it, right? Oh, grand meal, except they're vampires, so maybe not. Maybe invite guests. There we go. I just like having holidays oh. in my game. You want to <laughs> express devotion. Maybe we need your, like, relationship to kind of yeah. go down a little bit, because... Just saying. I mean, you've only just got married, so <laughs> maybe not, but... Let's go and continue writing our book. Oh, and we'll have a little baby for Christmas. Wait, what um lifespan do I have people on? Because obviously, vampires, they don't age up, but... Lifespan, normal. Why can I not? Uh, hello? Why can't I change that? Oh, age. Oh, uh, yes. Don't know why that was on. Should we keep it to normal? Yeah, for now I'll keep it on normal. Huh. I don't know why it was turned off, but oh, I prefer it boy. when they just age up organically. Maybe I'll be back when she's finished writing her book. <laughs> oh, social bunny. Mm -hmm. We did say that she wasn't probably going to go on the whole social media thing, though. Yeah. Nah, she's going to be... Maybe she can be a famous <laughs> author, but... An elusive one. Nobody knows who she is because she's a vampire. So he's still got this like deadened emotions. It's like I feel that's why he's like so cold to everybody. And yes, I know he's a vampire, but I feel like he's just cruel. Even though he says he's good, I don't believe him for one second. He's a serial. He wants to be a serial romantic. I'm just like, excuse me. Good Sims don't want that. <gasps> She's done it. She's written her book. Okay. 
Should we go publish it? I feel like Vlad's not going to be totally happy about you doing this, but why the heck is the post box? Uh, oh, it's there. Can sell to publisher. I have a feeling that Vlad's quite very um. Uh, oh. so. Buffetay. Wait, what's wrong with you? Why can't you get to it? Okay, she's just been weird. Wait, what? You've been nominated for an award? We're not going though because she wants to stay. Oh, to have a bath with soak. So there you go. She wants to stay elusive. Well, I think yeah. So I feel like Vlad is going to be quite traditional and being like, uh, I think you should probably quit your job. And also, I don't really particularly want you to be, you know, pursuing this writing. Um, obviously you can write for fun and that's fine. But then he won't know that she's actually, you know, publishing stuff. Cause it's gonna be in a different name. I feel like you need to sleep though. Go to sleep. Kinda want the baby to come this episode, but I don't know if it's going to. Cause I'm sure you're only in your... Oh no, you're in your second trimester. Okay, fair enough. And Vlad is up. He's hungry. Are you going to drink one of these? Yep, yeah, okay, you're doing it anyway. Can I plant that yet? Nope. Ugh, annoying. What's wrong with you? You don't like the cupboard? Oh, shut up. <laughs> What's... wait. He really doesn't like the morning and he also wants to do something romantic ask juniper about a date he doesn't like the day i don't i don't particularly care to be honest uh juniper's sleeping because juniper is carrying your baby and i'll go do what you want i oh, know she got morning sickness oh dear oh we can definitely see the baby now yeah, you see the contrast Shen where he's like playing chess and she's like on her phone. So I do feel like oh, he's quite traditional. <laughs> he wants to ask her about her day. Oh wait, she's got Dirty a little sick. <laughs> oh, okay, great. Hmm? Did you even do that? You say you want to ask her about her day, but you're like, no. He actually hasn't, like, uh -huh. felt the baby, though, or asked her about the baby or anything. Shady you have friends with all your kids, on. so... So what would I be me? <laughs> Make another sim happy. Uh, you're, Shabby like, sickly Kobe. good. It's... Fruit it's gross. <laughs> Discuss fears. Okay. Kimus. What are they doing? Are they both going to clean the toilet? Okay. Uh... Yeah, I'm gonna say, hon. What are you doing? What are you doing? I mean, at least he's cleaning up for you, but... You know, maybe Vlad is a good person, but I don't... Nah, nah, I got a bad feeling about this guy. He's not clean the toilet, though. Well, fine, thanks for that. She's got morning sickness again. She's gonna throw up again. She's not feeling overly great. Maybe it's because she's got, you know, a vampire baby. Do you want to ask Vlad about his day and express devotion? No. Uh, what do you want? You want to make someone good and you also want to volunteer. Well, she can't really volunteer, but you could go, I guess. Where is it? Volunteer. Just you. Go, uh... Do that. <laughs> That's what he wants to do. But she can't go out, I'm afraid. So now that she still needs to defeat Sims, but she kind of can't because she's pregnant. Maybe we can work on our second book though. Come on, we can we can write a love email. Oh, she got a royalties. Okay, so now that you're bitten, newly turned, how to deal with? Your new found thirst for the newly turned vampires. Do you have to really take the plasma of other sims or is there the options 
<laughs> I love making the book so I mean we could have maybe got like Liam over or something but I feel like she's trying to build an empire basically and she can't really do anything at the moment because she's pregnant so she can't like you know defeat the vampires she can't really work on that she's just got to do other things to create this empire whilst Vlad is just like I'm going to go volunteer oh Brightwing okay it's your dad you do know him oh Brightwing is I think Shanti's fox gib and I were just not meant to be oh sorry to hear that oh well see I feel now because he's back she should be like oh hi oh she's hungry um I don't know, change outfit to this and then get that. Oh, she's got to level 8 though of the writing skill. And then we can go and ask him about his day and just be, you know, oh. nice. <laughs> Where is he? Of course, just sat there. Okay. Well, you fly here. Because, you know, I feel like. Uh. <laughs> Apologise. <We're my> <laughs> well, I guess because he's probably not all that happy about. She is feeling uh, guilty, though, but annoying. she's not. Uh, she's, like, Parsifal. super energised. No I feel like because she's they're like, boring. I have a plan. Uh -huh. And he's <laughs> still <laughs> just Mousy. dead inside. She's like, I spoke to him, now I'm off. <laughs> He's gonna get suspicious if he just sit on that computer though, all day, even though, what's he doing? He, see, you're supposed to be like super nice and you're trolling the forums, where are you? <laughs> see, she was like feeling crap and he's like, nah, I'm just gonna go troll the forums. It's like, yeah, but, oh god, she's not feeling well. Maybe you should just go have a nap. To be fair, go have a nap. And he's like, oh yeah, I'm so nice, but I'm going to troll the forums. Okay. I thought you were a good sim. I thought good sims wouldn't do that. When are you like... Oh, what's this? You, oh, you do have a cold. Okay. Your third trimester in 11 hours. Fair enough. What are you doing? Oh. Okay, he's... <laughs> he's... Um not f looking so good huh okay well why is your energy just like depleted all the time like do you have like oh okay i think that's right because you have you you lose energy during the day okay fair enough well go to sleep god she's like <laughs> You're definitely pregnant, aren't you? Because you have the ni the walk and all sorts. Okay, but he's asleep now, so maybe you can come here and write a bit more. I like to think she's like teaching people how to succeed as a vampire because vampires just they just bite people and then like <laughs> that's it, bye. But like. She done it again. Oh yes. Okay, he's still asleep, isn't he? Okay. So let's go here. Cool. She's hungry again. And we've run out of these. Yeah, I, I'm definitely thinking that pregnant vampires get more hungry. Definitely. I think though I might leave this one here because she's not having that baby yet. <laughs> We're gonna have to wait, um, yeah, a little bit longer for her to have the baby, so that'll be in the next episode. Um, but can you like not look like that? Thank you. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, like I said, we will. Oh, didn't want to do that. Uh, we will 
come back in the next episode where she will probably be having the baby. Oh, Zarzuya. Oh, dear. Now she's just complaining. Uh. <sighs> hello. What? The heck? Wait, what is she doing in here? Where's she from? Why is she? Why is she celebrating her dad? What the heck? Mate, what are you doing? Is it because she texted him and was like, oh, you're getting more popular. So then she'd come to celebrate him and just stand there outside his room, staring at the door. That's not creepy. One bit at all. Not creepy at all. Now what's she doing? Would you really just take a picture of her, like, not feeling well? Dude. Oh, oh yeah, she's like your stepmother now, so uh, good luck with that. I was going to leave this here, but now, now I want to see what happens. <laughs> Last time we saw her, she kissed us, so. Just like, what was that all about? Sam Wavelength. Oh, she actually get along really well. Uh -huh. Surrounded by friends. See, she don't get that, like, when she's in Vlad, though. So I just don't think she likes Vlad all that much. Uh, what are you doing? Why are you flirting? What? Why did she just do that? This is what I mean. She's like, clearly likes Juniper. And it's like, dude, she's with your dad. You're being so weird. Ask what happened. Okay, I thought she was going to ask her to do something else. And I was just like, don't do that. It's a verb. I'm kind of invested now. But I'm, I am going to leave it. I'm pausing it, I'm gonna leave it. <laughs> like, why did you blow a kiss at her? I know Juniper's pretty, but like, come on, dude. That's your dad, you weirdo. That's your dad. Like, I know it's like stepmom, but just saying. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna leave it here now. <laughs> I was thinking, oh, this has been a chill episode, not much has really happened. They just tried for a baby and, you know, getting on with things. She's sneakily publishing books, fair enough. And then Brightwing just comes in and I'm like, oh, by the way, uh, let's flirt. Like, oh, dearie me. Okay, I'm going to leave it here. Okay. <laughs>